What's up everybody, it's Daydreams, welcome back to the channel for another Clash of Kings video. If you're new here, hit that red subscribe button down below so you can see daily videos just like this one where we're zeroing castles. A lot of guides on this strategy, tell your alliance about the channel, we'll make you guys a lot better. Okay, so we've got a Chinese castle here in the Kingdom Conquest, he ported to our hive, hit our player, who for some reason isn't shielded. Daywalker's not shielded either, these guys gotta get it together. Okay, he's scouting now, I'm gonna coordinate a skill attack. When I say go, everyone speed skill, okay? Everyone get ready for when I say. Okay, so someone's hitting monsters. Guys, come on now. Portuguese, why would you go and hit monsters right by him to let him know that we're awake? Come on, get your shit together, buddy. to spook him hitting all those monsters now he knows okay they they know i'm here we got to look like stupid we're gonna mark him we're gonna make sure our buffs are on ah, i just unmarked it make sure our buffs are on buffs are on skill is on okay it's lit up ready Make sure everyone's ready. We're going to say go, go, go in capital letters. Go, go, go fast. We're going to break that peace shield since layer one. And speed ups. Boom, boom. Where's the third one at? 199,000. There's a third one. He can't have that much power left. You know what? Just for the video, just for you guys, and just for the sake of savagery. We lost 20k, but we finished him off. And someone else went in there, too. Obstruction hit him in last time as well. We got him. We got him. So we lost 20k troops. No big deal. We'll speed train those bad boys back up. But he ate a big one, guys. That's what matters the most. Let's take a look at all the reports. There's the second report where we lost 20,000 troops. So I guess what, guys? I'm smarter than the average bear. Look at all my T10s. Do you see any losses? Why? Why, Daydreams? Boom! 18,000 t7 guard with my losses i send like 20k t7 guard in marches so then i only lose 100k power instead of like 300k power that's the way you got to do it you gotta you gotta be smarter than the average bear that's beautiful how beautiful oh wait did rick finish him off damn rick hit him too must that must have been that hit after me he didn't care about the losses either i'm gonna show rick about that t7 guard strategy too because it does um Okay, so we, I think, um, yeah, Obstruction hit him first, so Obstruction went too fast. Obstruction's got my old castle, so it's strong, but he, um, he hit too fast and he didn't have, he didn't put any March boost on. I need to, I need to, uh, make sure to show him how to put the March boost on it, because he should have had about a 250,000 troop March. Um, let's go check. Then we hit him, put him down 200k, down to 539. Then I believe Rick hit him, and then Payne hit him. Or no, wait. Payne might have hit him next. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Payne hit him next. Payne didn't have much of a march boost on either, it appears. He's got that cavalry. Payne's almost a prestige uh, 5, though. He's a prestige 4. He's the only prestige, non-prestige 5 that hit it. But he had a nice hit, too. And then Rick came in there swinging. Right there. 300k. And then I think I came in and finished that last 133 off, right? That's my second report. Yep. Ba-boom. Dead. So, because he was in the enemy kingdom, he doesn't get any hospital bonus either. So, he's d -d 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 dead 
Dead, dead, dead. And I hope he... It's funny his name is Bot. B-O-T. Because they all bot. They're just like, you know what? We're not even going to hide the fact that we bot now. We all have level 30 prestige castles because we all bot. And those of us with, with prestige 5, we got, you know, uh, prestige 5 castles because we bought and we spent a bunch of money for the badges. If these guys could bot badges, they would. That's why there's all this stuff that you got to spend money on in the game because all these people botting ruined the game. I'm going to say it here. If you ever want to know what happened when to the glory days of Clash of Kings where you could build to a max castle without spending a dollar, all you needed was time and hard work. It's because of people like this that are botting and buying stuff. Sorry about people in the background. High stakes games going on. I've got family over. That's why I didn't stream tonight. But, you know, I got to, uh, I had to come in here and do this because someone sent me a message saying that, uh, you know, we had someone in the hive. So I had to, I had to come in here and, uh, I had to come in here and, you know, leave the nuts hanging out. And he got it good. He looks like a turkey now. He's going to gobble all the way home. Um, turkeys cannot fly, so those wings are useless. Actually, turkeys can fly a little bit. I've seen them fly, you know, like they'll fly like up into a tree, but they can't fly very far. He's not going to be able to fly back to China, but uh, he should be able to fly back to Kingdom 836. Um, but I will, I will be going to their kingdom here soon, guys. I don't have my skill attack because I couldn't... You can't let people come in and disrespect your home. Like, when someone comes to your home, you know, this is our house. You know what I mean? So thank you guys so much for watching. Remember that teamwork makes your work. Smash the thumbs up button. If you want to subscribe to this channel, click my link right up there at the top left. It's popping up right now. If you want to watch an awesome ancient battlefield video, go ahead and click that um, link that's popping up in the bottom right. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.